Don't let the music, if you can hear it, fool you. This isn't a, a, a rock concert. You can see behind me the posters of, of the hostages and, and hear tents set up showing the hostages. This is a base where the prime minister and other members of the cabinet work on military issues regarding what's going on with Gaza and getting the hostages home. The hostages are in a weird way, a, a hot button issue because there are those who are demanding the government get the hostages back from Hamas. Of course, Hamas taking uh, Israelis hostage when they engage their terrorist attack on October 7th. They want their people home. They want their children home. They want their parents home. They want their friends home as quickly as possible. And it doesn't matter what the cost is. Get them home. Then whatever you're going to do to Hamas, go do the other side which would be the more political right side, if you will, is saying you cannot negotiate with these people. You have to end Hamas now. So across Israel, there are these protests happening. Now this is in Tel Aviv. There are two different areas where this takes place. One that is, is actually called Hostage Square, and then where we are right now. As we were driving back from Jerusalem, we saw the march maybe a thousand people marching up the road and it is up you're heading north uh, i shouldn't say north you're heading up a hill to get to jerusalem marching to jerusalem to demand that the israeli government work in a much more aggressive fashion to put an end to this and to get the hostages back and so these protests continue the question is are they right or are they wrong